Hello, how are you? A cataract is a partial or total clouding of the lens of the eye. It blocks the passage of light to the retina. Nerve cells in the retina detect light entering the eye and send signals to the brain. Because cataracts block this light, they can cause vision problems. This disease is common in older people. But the changes caused by aging do not always lead to cataracts. People with a family history of cataracts can also develop cataracts. Sometimes even children are born with cataracts. Aging and exposure to sunlight can cause them. But eye changes caused by aging do not always lead to cataracts. Cataracts can also occur after an eye injury or disease, after the use of certain medications, or as a result of health problems such as diabetes. Many times cataracts do not cause any vision problems. Symptoms may include cloudy, blurred or foggy vision. Headlights from other cars can be a problem for driving at night. Even spectacle prescriptions may need to be changed frequently. But in general, vision loss caused by cataracts usually comes on slowly. And it may never become serious. Your doctor can find out if you have cataracts by checking your eyes and by questioning you about your symptoms and health. You may need tests to be sure of the diagnosis or to rule out other conditions that may be causing vision problems. Surgery is the only way to remove them. It works well and helps you see better. But surgery may not be necessary or may be delayed for months or years. Many people with cataracts do very well with the help of glasses, contact lenses or other visual aids. We have covered this topic in this link, where we discuss the issues to consider about whether to have surgery or wait. Advanced age family history of cataracts or certain genetic conditions. Diabetes, persistent blood glucose levels can damage the lens of the eye. Surgery to treat glaucoma. Smoking. This causes free radicals to form, which damage cells, including those in the lens. Infections during pregnancy, such as rubella or chickenpox. These can cause the baby to develop a cataract before birth. Exposure to ultraviolet light. Long-term use of high doses of steroids, which are often prescribed for conditions such as asthma or emphysema. It has not been proven that cataracts can be prevented. However, some lifestyle habits can help slow the growth of cataracts. These include not smoking, wear a hat or sunglasses to protect you from the sun, avoiding sun lamps and tanning booths, good nutrition, Avoiding or minimizing the use of steroids. Control diabetes. As the cataract progresses, more of the lens becomes opaque. If the entire lens turns white, serious vision problems occur. Delaying surgery until this point is not recommended. But they do not always progress in this way, they may remain small and go unnoticed. Often they do not seriously affect vision, so they do not need to be removed. But of course, vision loss can affect driving, work, reading or hobbies, leading to a loss of independence. There is also a rare type of cataract that can cause glaucoma, a disease characterized by increased pressure inside the eye and other signs that can lead to blindness. Contact your doctor as a matter of urgency if you have severe eye pain, sudden loss of vision, or double vision. Contact your doctor to discuss your symptoms if you have. You need frequent changes in your eyeglass prescription. You have blurred or double vision that develops slowly. You have vision problems during the day due to glare. You have problems driving at night due to headlight glare. You have vision problems that hinder your daily activities. In any case, it is advisable to discuss with your doctor the most appropriate frequency of eye examinations. 
This is a wait-and-see approach, which is a safe and appropriate strategy in most adult cataract cases. Of course, surgery to remove cataracts should be discussed with the eye care professional. In most cases, you can decide whether you want or need surgery based on whether your vision problems interfere with daily activities, i.e., whether they compromise your independence. If you have cataracts, you can manage your vision problems at home and avoid or delay surgery. For example, you can use a soft backlight plus a task light, avoid glare from television and computer screens. You can also reorient the lights in the room and use blinds on windows to avoid glare. Keep the prescription of glasses or contact lenses up to date. Use sunglasses that protect against ultraviolet A and B rays. Use technological aids, such as accessibility enhancements on mobile phones, or voice assistants. Use a magnifying glass to read on paper if the print is not large enough, or use the device's settings to increase the size of the text. Protect your eyes by avoiding falls. Adjust carpets, or better still, do without them, and arrange furniture and electrical wiring to prevent tripping. Cataract surgery involves removing the cloudy lens of the eye, the cataract. In most cases, the lens is replaced with an artificial lens called an intraocular lens implant. If you have no other eye disease, your chances of seeing better after the operation are very good. But you may still need glasses for reading or driving at night. There are several types of cataract surgery. FACO emulsifican, small incision surgery with ultrasound. This is the most common method. Extracapsular cataract extraction. Femtosecond laser assisted cataract surgery. But we are not going to go into these technicalities in depth. I hope you have found this information useful and easy to understand. Thank you very much, and see you next time.